So before you start mowing, it's always a good idea just to check that the cylinder and bottom blade are correctly adjusted. These are preset in the factory, but during transport, uh, there is the potential that these could move, um, taking them off cut. So we check this by tilting the machine back and then just using a standard piece of writing paper, uh, tear that into about an inch width strip and then just fold that over. Uh, on these uh, buff Buckingham mowers we have a fixed cylinder which is in between two bearings and we then have a bottom blade uh, which we then raise and lower to meet the cylinder uh, depending on what contact we're trying to achieve. So the cylinder and the bottom blade act as a pair of scissors uh, so that's basically the cutting action we are after. So we want the cylinder to just lightly brush over the bottom blade, just creating that light scissor cut action. So to adjust the bottom blade, we have two adjusters on each side of the machine. And basically these are acting against a pivot system, which then activate the bottom blade assembly to raise or lower against the, the cylinder. So the top adjuster, we want to slacken. But first we'll just, just check the cut. So we are just, just basically folding the paper over. So if we were to cut with this action, it will basically be tearing the blades of grass, which would be, uh, which would be damaging to the, the plant itself. So we want to bring the cylinder closer, to the bottom blade closer to the cylinder. So we slacken the top adjusters about a quarter of a turn, and then we do the same then with the bottom. So we take the, the top one off, quarter of a turn, and then bring the bottom adjuster on, quarter of a turn. And then we just check again. So we're just cutting paper, but slightly too tight, so we'll just slacken that off slightly. So we'll just come off on the bottom one, and then on on the top one. Take the other side off. So we're getting a nice clean cut on there, and you want to check that all the way along. So we're getting a nice clean scissor cut action, you can see there's no tears to the edge of the paper, and that's basically the, the contact we are after, so just you can just hear the, the cylinder lightly brushing over the bottom blade, and you're getting a nice clean, clean cut as well. So if we're cutting paper, then we will be cutting grass cleanly as well.